एवरीवन वेलकम टू पीएचडी टीनियर वेयर वी डिस्कस पीएचडी माइंडसेट एंड पर्सनल फाइनेंस टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू स्पीक अबाउट अ टूल व्हिच इज एक्चुअली इनडिस्पेंसेबल इन माय वर्क एज वेल एज एकेडमिक नोट राइटिंग एंड आई वांट टू टेक यू थ्रू इट से सपोज यू आर अ स्टूडेंट रिसर्चर टीचर और एनीबॉडी हु वांट्स टू टेक नोट्स फ्रॉम पीडीएफ्स ओके सो देयर आर टू ऑप्शंस one thing you can take highlighted and copy paste it somewhere second you can take notes physically you can highlight it and then transfer into a notebook manually so today i will show you how the highlights that you take from pdfs can sync automatically to a digital platform so what i mean by that is whatever you highlight on the pdf you don't have to manually write it or you don't have to manually copy paste it it will get automatically copy pasted to a folder and i think this is a very useful feature because we have to sometimes read tons and tons of pdfs to get as a part of our work or as part of research so this is a very important feature which helps you to automate your notes and i will show you exactly how to do that to begin with i am going to use a note taking platform or note writing platform you can say which is notion so if you are using evernote then also this can work and to some other uh, tools also that you will have to check and there is something called as readwise we will start with readwise first and then we will move on to notion before that we will see how this highlighting feature works now here i have a pdf i'm opening it okay so right now i have this pdf in front of me i have not really highlighted anything as i want to show you how this works let me highlight say suppose i want to copy this text somewhere these are important notes notes and i want to copy it somewhere what i can do basically is just select it copy and i can paste somewhere this is one thing that you can do but if say suppose this paper now has 24 pages every now to copy and paste is a it is very time consuming and especially if you are a, a student or somebody who has to read papers on a daily basis then it is difficult so what i can do is i can go to comments okay select highlight and the first step is to highlight this so now i have a, a paper where this portion is highlighted and now i will show you how this text will get exported automatically okay so let me highlight some other notes also um let me highlight this okay let me highlight this so basically we have highlighted three notes 1 2 and 3 okay the tool that i will use for importing this is called as readwise and let me take you to the website go to this website readwise.io click on it it will ask you to register register an account since i have already registered i will go to the dashboard okay now when you go to the dashboard i have been using this for some time so there are a few details if you have never used it then all this would be blank now that we have reached on the dashboard there is something called as import and there is something called as export so you click on import now this can take highlights from kindle supplemental books pocket so what we are interested in over here is pdf okay because we have highlighted in pdf so you click on import upload a pdf file here it would be this is the file where we have highlighted upload it okay 
okay so this uh, done this 97 highlights these are total but these are the three you remember we had highlighted three of these okay now what you do is back to dashboard now this is the interesting part this i am telling from a beginner perspective once you set up all the connections what will happen is it will uh, sync automatically okay you go to export you go to notion you select notion okay from all this now these are if you are using evernote obsidian rome it uh, it can also export as csv markdown or whatever i am using notion okay those who don't know notion notion is a note taking platform and i basically use it as a repository for all my notes so uh, you can do it in ms word also I just prefer Notion uh, as I find it easier to categorize everything. And what you can do is click on configure. This export automatically should be checked on. Okay, the, you can tick, as a beginner you can click on tick on the first three options. Okay, now if you have you are doing this for the first time it will ask you the workspace okay so if uh, you are if you have used notion before you know that there are several workspaces so the workspace that i have set for notion is life that is the name of my notion workspace it could be different for you so you just have to set things for the first time and then i will say start export to life now you see what will happen now it is coming as success exported zero new highlights because the moment i had uploaded my pdf that time only all the highlights got synced because i had already set up this earlier okay uh, i just showed you the setting up procedure for those who are new to this tool and i will take you to my notion interface this is my notion interface here see there will be a page called as readwise okay if i click on that the highlight got synced see chapter 2 the, uh, these are my previous highlights the highlight that we did now is chapter 2 valorization of food let me click on that and show you open page and these are the three highlights this is one this is two this is three so you don't have to manually do it okay the it seems very, uh, quite daunting at first but trust me it is very easy we are in readwise now so this i showed you only for the purpose of beginners and uh, if you are doing this for the first time okay the next time you do is what will happen is you go on connect and sync import highlights go to pdfs okay upload a file and the moment you upload a file it will get the highlights that you have uploaded the highlights that are there on the pdf file will automatically get synced to your notion database okay so the export highlights feature you need not click why because you had already set it uh, to sync automatically and that is a wonderful uh, part of this platform Alternatively, what you can do is instead of uploading, you can also email it to email the highlighted PDF file to add at readwise.io and your highlights will get automatically synced. It will get automatically exported to your notion database. Is this free? No, it is not free. The charge for normal members is around $8. Uh, for students, it is uh, they are giving 50% off. So if you are having an educational ID, then you just have to mail them from your educational ID that you are a student and maybe uh, attach your ID card or something and they will send a link. So once they send a link, what will happen is if you register from that link, so then you will get 50% uh, off on every month. 
if you are billing it month wise if you are billing it annually then also you will get 50% off i think 4 dollars a month is a good amount if it is helping you maintain your sanity and organize your notes in a way that it saves you any kind of headache so that's all i wanted to tell you it's a it's a very good feature and if you are using obsidian or evernote or other platforms also this can sync also it uh, readwise can import highlights from kindle and other article saving platforms like insta paper but i don't use all those i primarily use pdfs so that is why i showed you this this can save a lot of time and a lot of your energy in organizing notes in one place. That's it for today. Thank you.